Touch the demon <laughs> inside me, inside me. Mira san, konnichiwa. Eh, Brad Bond no direct. We await thy return. From Soft and Miyazaki. Honditsua, Brad Bond, no Atarashi Yoso, Seihai Dungeon, and Sita, Bosho Kashi. Bearer of the curse, seek those whose names are Brad Bond, no, Jew Ijo Armap, no Hitot, Yana Munochkani, Ixoni Matate Hirogar, Sky Sekino Potones, Rogue Like Game, Seisei Dungeon, and Sita, 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 the Story of Serso, Chapter 1 The journey begins with a young Serso, surrounded by his family around their campfire. His older brothers, Melvin and Mingus, along with his mother and father. Serso, when will you ever learn to read? You're 13 years old! Minkus! Are you going to pound some literacy into him? Great idea, Melvin. Serso, one day you'll thank me for this. Yeah! Uh, Minkus? Did you knock him out? We're supposed to be leaving soon. Melvin! Minkus! It's time for us to go! The boat is leaving and we're running late. We can't miss the boat to Andor Landor. Grab your things and don't forget your resin. Sure, sure thing, thing Mom. Mom! The Yeet family left for Andor Landor, leaving Cerso behind, which is exactly what Melvin and Minkus wanted. Cerso was confused. Why did his family leave without him? Why did his head hurt? He had to find his family. But the boat to Andor Landor would not be back for years, so he would have to get there the long way, on foot. Cerso traversed the dangers of Bullet Town with all the treasure and dangers that came with it. The pangentrific enemies lay in a pile of yeet vanquished by Cerso. Trinkets, baubles, gold and loot all collected by Cerso. And maybe most surprising to Cerso, an unexpected friendship. Cerso, you have slayed the powerful demons and proved your worth. Why do you look so sad? I've loved getting to know you, Cerso. You have touched my soul deeply. I appreciate everything you have done for Bullet Town and me. I cannot see it with my eyes. But I can feel your future deep within me. Would you like to see it, Cerso? Grab my hand. Cerso, I know you. You think there is no way this could be your future. But I assure you, if you leave Bullet Town, you will face your own demons bigger than anything here. You can't change your future, Cerso. You do not have to chase your family. You can stay here, in Bullet Town, and live a simple life. Cerso, I must warn you. There are things that I have seen in your future that you did not. There is much heartache in your future. Who you think you want may not want you. There is much greed in your future. What you think you want may not be what it seems. Beware, Cerso. I have seen these things be the end of you. Is that what you wish to chase? Appreciate where you are. You do not have to leave. Stay here in Bullet Town and digress before you make a decision. Battle weary and pogged out of his mind, Cerso decided to rest in Bullet Town with the Wax Maiden. After weeks of enjoying the <coughs> fruits of Bullet Town, Cerso came to a decision. Cerso, wait! I have to tell you something. Cerso, I'm pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> 